you yourself has, have studied quite a few degrees and qualifications. Do you think education is the most important factor in trying to promote social justice issues? I think the most important factor promoting social justice is love. And basically you learn that first in your home. Uh, I think having love at home uh, in your relationships with your parents and your siblings and your extended family is a very good preparation in life to having love for your community and for uh, people who are in minorities and who are slightly different from you. And certainly that was the upbringing I had. Now it isn't always easy for you to procure that. Some people never have that at home and it's not their fault. But uh, if we can inculcate uh, a loving attitude to fellow human beings in the home, in the school, at the university, then I think that's a very good preparation for life. A lot of people in our communities who have to confront, are confronted with social justice issues, be it homelessness or in and out of jail or recidivism, how can they confront the issue if love isn't in the household? Well, they'll need help and uh, a law school ought to be a place of help. It ought to be a place which is teaching young citizens to be engaged with the less fortunate in society. Now fortunately the cohort of students who are coming into the University of Wollongong, unlike some law schools in Australia, uh, are representative of the whole variety of the socio-economic backgrounds of the community and the district. And that's a good thing because it means that the people who will be making the important decisions in the law in the future won't simply be an elite who have been selected from a very expensive education but who've gone to the local public school, have experienced the whole range of uh, human, the human condition and who can empathise with people and try to work out practical solutions, who can work for legal aid and community legal centres uh, and who can reach out to people who are uh, not being well served in the law. Law is not only there for the big end of town. Law is there for everybody and the legal needs of poorer people are different from the legal needs of uh, big fat rich corporations. The corporations have to have their lawyers and their rights are just as important. But getting law to people who are less wealthy and less fortunate is often a challenge. If you get to the law, it's generally fair and neutral and uh, works for justice. But getting to the law is our big challenge and that's why I think the University of Wollongong and its law school are very well positioned. I have very great respect for this law school. Uh, two of my associates in the High Court of Australia, Lisa Arcioni and James Goodcamp, were selected from the University of Wollongong and they were right up there with the best. So you can be proud of this law school and I'm always happy to come here and I'm proud to be here today.